Hi guys and girls, um, sorry it's been a little while, I'm not out portable, um, my work commitments are, are taking a lot of my time at the moment, so uh, hopefully I'll be out soon. Um, I've recently acquired this MFJ um, portable antenna, the MFJ1621, and uh, I just thought uh, I'd let you see how it performs on receive, uh, so I've not to get out in the field, uh, but I will do. Um, it is new. Uh, it looks a very dated construction, but um, it serves its purpose. Um, the box itself is um, of plastic and uh, it's like a Bakelite type um, screen printed uh, cover on the top there. Uh, this whip is it's an SO239 connection and you get 50 metres of um, RG58 uh, coax. And uh, the, the uh, knobs and buttons speak for themselves, the, the uh, sensitivity, the band selector and the uh, matching. And there's a field strength meter there. Now this actually also comes with a, like a neoprene sleeve um, for the antenna. Uh, I would imagine that is just uh, there for, um, to protect against uh, coming into contact with the antenna and getting some nasty RF burns. Uh, this will deal with a max power of 200 watts, uh, believe it or not. Um, not that I would want this sat next to me anyway, uh, hence why you've probably got 50 meters, uh, sorry, 50 feet of uh, RG58 uh, when running 200 watts. Uh, not that my license conditions allows me to do that anyway. Uh, so what I've got set up is I've got a, 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 an antenna switch here. Um, one antenna is my uh, 9 to 1 N fed, uh, which is 20 meters long, which goes around the uh, the border of my garden stroke yard. And um, the other position of the switch is uh, this actual unit here. So um, I'll uh, cut over to my uh, ICOM IC705. Uh, as you can see, I've still got the screen protector on the radio. But anyway, so I'm listening now to, to 40 metres. Um, if you pay particular attention to the um, the waterfall. Now this is on the 9 to 1 end fed. Now I'm going to switch over to uh, the MFJ1621. So quite surprising really. Um, there is a bit of difference in there in the way of gain. As you can see the peaks there on the um, scope. Now I've switched it off. You can just see a lot of the, the, the noise disappears. But um, it's quite impressive considering it's indoors. Um, it may not be a true reflection as uh, the, the antenna switch may be uh, sharing a, a common um, common earth. But, uh, but you can definitely see the difference there. So it's not bad. So just a short one, guys. Um, oh, um, I'm on the uh, MFJ1621 now. Uh, in the way of the bands it covers, I believe it's uh, 40 through till to 10. Uh, 40, 30, 20, 15, 12 and 10. So uh, anyway, I'll say 73 and uh, catch you very soon. Stay safe.